Hello viewer, I'll show you software automation testing tool Selenium Setup. In order to Selenium Setup, what you need to, uh, here is the list. You need download and extract Selenium, no need to install. Here is the link. Then you need to download Eclipse. Eclipse has many different version. You can do whatever you like to. Mm, here is the link you don't need to install just download and extract here is the important part of you need JDK in order to run the selenium so mm, uh, here is the link also you can download from JDK based on your computer version 64 bit or 32 bit install JUnit or testng JUnit and testng both are test runner but I will use testng for selenium so test ng i'll install through the eclipse i'll show you how to do that also you need gecko driver so download gecko driver from the following link and here is gecko driver uh, you don't need to install just uh, download and extract that's all you needed for selenium setup now i will show you step by step how you will set up that so after here is uh, the selenium setup i have the folder once you download eclipse gecko driver selenium if you extract you will get all this extract version is over here so put it in a uh, in one place so that navigation should be easier for you so that's why i put all the folder in one file selenium setup like that way Let's say I want to open the Eclipse. You see there is a application file in Eclipse. Just double click over here. It will open the Eclipse. So when you Eclipse is asking workspace where your work will be saved. This workspace I, I created one workspace, Selenium workspace. I will open that one. So you can put different places whatever you like basically it is on project folder launch selenium eclipse eclipse is launching uh, once eclipse is launch i'll show you okay this is the eclipse it is a startup page if you uncheck this one it will not show you next time opening click this is the eclipse workspace you have to set up your selenium project over here so first thing there is a help button called eclipse marketplace once it will open then you will see it takes little time it is opening uh, almost it doesn't take that much time but give me a little moment once it is pop up okay it's ready just type over here test ng then go and search you see test ng for eclipse here is installed if it is not installed just install that that's all you need okay i'm canceling because it is installed already cancel so first you have to go file new java project project then go to java project next put the project name let's say it is test project then click finish open prospective remember my decision if you click then next time it will not give you that pop up okay your project is created over here if you expand that there is a system library and src means source folder select the source folder and right click new package after project you have to create the package package name basically it is the reverse in the domain name com dot let's say we will open google home page g double g l in google finish this project name the package name it basically depends on the project you are working on then once package is created right click on the package new other you see here test ng test ng expand that test ng class next 
so here you have to select up to source then new test you can uh, test Google then you select before method after method just now select these two later on I will explain whatever the test and the annotation how test and the annotation works let's finish you see all are the red mark test before method after method so if you mouse over over here there is a suggestion what you want to do add test ng library you see library is added over here and all the red mark is gone you can just reorganize your test let's say before method is like a before means before so i am taking that method in before all about then test then after method you have to write the code within two curly braces okay this is my test now selenium till selenium is not added over here so if you go to the test project right click properties java build path libraries add external jar i have to go where my selenium is so first take this to jar file open then click again add external jar library folder select all open your apply and close your selenium a jar file is added in your project now first thing at the class level we are doing selenium web driver web driver driver equal to a new ln no web driver is a interface of selenium if here is the red mark what is the option is if you mouse over over here you see import web driver we imported web driver over here if you expand import location there is a web driver that's why its red mark is gone first thing you have to set your gecko driver so system dot set properties properties set property key value web driver dot z c can gecko dot driver now value is gecko driver path where is your gecko driver is let's say we have download i have gecko driver over here what is the path is this is the path let's take the path over here and put that gecko driver backslash z e c k o gecko driver dot e x c and that is let's expand little bit so that i can see whole code here you have to put the semicolon okay now driver equal to new firefox driver a firefox driver it is a red mark if you mouse over import firefox driver in your project okay now driver dot manage dot timeout driver dot manage dot implicitly dot manage dot timeout sorry manage dot uh, 
timeout dot implicit weight let's say 10,000 10 seconds and then time unit dot seconds this and then driver dot navigate dot two double dot google dot com http clone slash slash then google is navigated s y s o control space let's say google home page display it in the test section i put s y s o test executed let's say after method s y s o after method e executed this outlet on case it will open the google home page then i put the message that home page is displayed all the message this is basically my first test how to set up and run the initial script so make sure you have to save that right click run as test ng test it is running it is uh, firefox browser open it's navigated to the google home page that's done my test you see it is executed google home page displayed one thing first before method it works test executed test work after method works this is all about your first script i'll prepare all the selenium tutorial step by step if you like this setup tutorial please make your comment if you have any question also please make your comment thank you